See, we can teach me the path of darkness. That is exactly what we want to do. Yes, witchy poo. We're going to become a witch. She's turning me into a witch. She did it. <gasps> Hello, YouTube. My name is Sarah. And today I'm going to be playing through nostalgia by playing a pack of The Sims Past. And today we're going to be playing the last expansion pack of The Sims 2, which was Apartment Life. Now, I never had Apartment Life. And actually something I've learned throughout making all of these videos on The Sims 2, I really did not have very many packs at all when I was playing The Sims 2. So I've never played Apartment Life before. All I know about it is what I have done research on myself and I'm excited to get into it because we've got apartments which is exciting but there's also witches I'm not quite sure what about apartments made the sims team for the sims 2 go witches <laughs> I just I'm not quite sure why that decision was made but I'm not mad about it so with that being said let's jump into the sims 2 and let's live in an apartment and maybe see a witch We are accurately hearing this title music. Just like with The Sims 1 making magic, this is the music that came with The Sims 2 Apartment Life. Thank you so much, West Anime Sims, for letting me know that a few videos ago. I love this music. It is the best. I just could listen to it all day. It's so relaxing. Anyway, we're not going to listen to it all day because we've got Belladonna Cove right here. This is the neighborhood that came with Apartment Life. So from far and wide, Sims have been drawn to beautiful Belladonna Cove. Some are looking for a quiet place to settle down others to tango with the hustle and bustle of the more exciting districts and a distinct few who have been drawn by rumors of mystical energies will they all be able to get along well let me just tell you right now i have definitely been drawn by the rumors of mystical energies let's have a look at belladonna cove really quick There's Bella. Beauty, 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 Bella, Bella, Bella. Is that why it's called Belladonna Cove, by the way? I don't know. Maybe someone can tell me why there's a statue of Bella Goth in Belladonna Cove. That'd be great. I'm really quickly going to make a new sim. I will see you on the other side of Create a Family. Five minutes later. Here I have got uh, Ms. Poo. Her first name is Witchy. And if you're familiar with Witchy Poo from HR Puff and stuff, well, there's some great creator sim dresses and outfits for sims that came with apartment life. But when I saw this custom content dress that I had, I just could not freaking resist. Now, I have made a video on my old Sims 2 CC. This is all stuff that I've had from back when I was playing the Sims 2. A lot of the CC is emo. So if that's kind of your thing, I will leave a link to that video in the description down below. I've also used some custom content eyes. We've got purple eyes. So I want her to become a witch in this video, but I want her specifically to become an evil witch. I want her skin to turn green. All right, let's find an apartment block to move into. You know, I really like the look of these little apartments because this is kind of like, they're like little townhouses in a block of townhouses. I kind of like that. Let's rent this one. Oh my goodness gracious. Do I get to pick one? I can. Okay, okay. So we've got 1,806 simoleons for the green one. For this white one, we've got 1,902. For the blue one, we've got 1,825. For the red one, we've got 1,824. So I might go with the green one. For multiple reasons, I want to go with the green one. Uh, firstly, because I want her to be an evil witch and they turn green. So I feel like that's appropriate. So let's just rent this apartment. Thanks for renting this apartment. You were charged your first week's rent of 1,806 simoleons. Rent will be due every Monday. You can always call me if you run into any problems. Sick. That is so good. So let me just quickly throw some furniture in here. Tink, tinky, dinky, winky. Tink, tinky, winky, winky. Obviously, we have this gorgeous little apartment. It's super cute. I did want to furnish a second bedroom, though, because I did want to look at inviting a roommate to come and live in this place with us. I forgot to grab a phone because I always forget to grab phones in The Sims 2. I forget that they are a thing that you actually need to have. 
because I'm pretty sure that you can place an ad for a roommate by the phone. So that's the first thing we're going to do immediately. Oh, we're meeting. Oh, this is our landlord. There we go. My name has been signed on the dotted line. Thank you so much for letting me rent this apartment. Would I like to place a free advertisement for a roommate? Why, yes, indeed I would. Your advertisement has been placed. You should expect to receive calls from prospective roommates shortly. Fantastic, fantastic. And then I'm seeing there's these little, like parks next to these apartments but i'm pretty sure there's an actual park to go to now specifically i have mentioned that i want to become a witch in this video so i think i'm actually going to go back downstairs because witches they turn up on community lots now i've been very lucky in past videos i've encountered witches multiple times and never actually meant to so i'm hoping that i can have a very very easy time encountering a witch so i'm gonna call we're gonna call a taxi we're gonna go somewhere to a community lot and hopefully immediately encounter an evil witch i would like to be an evil witch so i'm gonna be waiting until i encounter an evil witch but that should hopefully also be easy for me because all of the witches that i have encountered so far in the sims 2 have all been atrociously evil so <laughs> okay it looks like the apartment is in great shape there's nothing for me to do i'll be back tomorrow okay landlord no worries kale so they check in daily that's interesting all right well here we are we're at the central park this is pretty cute and this is what I meant. There is actually, oh, that's in the Central Park East. But again, it's playground equipment. Oh, so good. So good. I would love to have some more playground equipment for The Sims 4. You guys, from what I know, from the research that I've done, it can take a while for witches to come to the lot. I could literally be here all day today and I could literally be here all day tomorrow for a witch to turn up. And I know that you can like cheat your Sims to become witches, but I don't want to cheat. I want to do this the legit way. So I will check in with you once a witch turns up 12 seconds later <gasps> it was immediate we've immediately got an evil witch a witch has flown in our witch has flown in it was it's literally been like 20 seconds since i last spoke to you and we've got a witch so francis mcculloch the atrociously evil witch now importantly we only have an hour to interact with this witch before she leaves so we're gonna greet francis mcculloch Witchy Prue is on the way to speak to you. How exciting. Oh, goodness gracious. Now, we need to become friendly with this witch in order for this witch to uh, be able to turn me into a witch. So, hi, Francis. Hi, how's it going? Hi, hey, hello. Now, please excuse me. I'm immediately nervous because socializing in The Sims 2 is not my strong point. <laughs> We're going to get as friendly as we can before the witch leaves. Just friendly to a point where I can call her. For what I know, you need 50 daily friendship, which is like the top bar here. And then you need 20 of this bottom bar in order to, for your Sim to be able to be turned into a witch. So we're already at two. We've got eight. 18 to go for that one and we're at zero with the other one so it's gonna be interesting <laughs> let's just see how we go okay it's going a little bit well i don't know maybe it's not she just doesn't like chatting i don't think i don't think she likes chatting sometimes i think things are going really well and then they turn around but things are going well i find we're at 35 in the daily bar if i can get to 50 before this witch leaves that'd be amazing that would be so good it's going bad now. It's going bad. Is she leaving? Is she leaving? She might be leaving. I don't know. She's doing some magic. She be doing some magic indeed. Yes, she do. What is she be doing? Oh, she be making it rain. She be making it rain. But not with money. Just actual rain. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're friends. We are officially friends. 61. This is so good. Maybe, maybe, hold on a second. Maybe I'm better at socializing in The Sims 2 than I thought. I don't know. I feel like this is going well. <laughs> is that her familiar? Oh my goodness. Francis is familiar. Oh my gosh. Cute little kitty cat. How adorable. Love it. Oh, hey, hey. That's her roaches, Benjamin. That's her roaches that you're spraying. She hated that. For sure. <gasps> Another witch has turned up. Another witch has turned up. Oh my God, we got two witches in the same place? I just wasn't expecting so many witches all of a sudden in this place. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh my God, Blair? Blair just scared Francis's familiar away. So far, he's the only atrociously evil one. 
All right, Francis, we are at 87 daily. We are friends. That's amazing. That is so good. We are at seven on the lower bar. So I think I'm going to go home. It needs are getting a little bit low. We'll take care of needs. I'm actually going to speed through because this might take a couple of days of me calling on the phone. So I will speed through until we get that 20 bar that we need. That's, that's going to be the goodness. So I'll see you then. A few moments later. I completely forgot about the roommates, though. I completely forgot that I did that. So the roommate postings for the day, Ryan Wheeler, he's a clam wrangler. The fact that he's super neat might be super helpful for an apartment because he'll keep the place clean. He's got some mechanical skill. He's got some body, a little bit of logic, creativity, and cleaning. I like that. I'm Ryan, welcome to the freaking apartment, my guy. There he is with his suitcase moving in. I completely forgot that I'd done the roommate thing. Hello, thank you so much for choosing me as your roommate. I'm really looking forward to living here. Ryan. Ryan's a little bit weird though. He One of his wants is to be saved from death. That's interesting. Ah, satisfaction bar. I was wondering about this. So roommate satisfaction. So he's happy at the moment. That's great. Love to see that. <laughs> It has officially happened. We are at 96 and we are at 22. So today, this morning, we're going to call Francis over. We're going to be turned into a witch. I'm so excited. Oh, boy. She's so excited right now. Can you see the excitement on her face? I'm excited too. Oh, she is doing magic. Is she going to change the weather? Yes, of course she is. Thunderstorms. It's the perfect weather for a witch. <gasps> See, we can teach me the path of darkness. That is exactly what we want to do. Yes, witchy poo. We're going to become a witch. She's turning me into a witch. She's turning me into a witch. She did it. <gasps> oh my God, that's so freaking cool. You may now walk the path of darkness. As a gift, please accept this spell book and cauldron. Use them to hone your skills so that you may learn to create chaos and disorder wherever you roam. Oh, fantastic. I learned a new spell. I should check my spell book to find out more about it. That is so exciting. So her skin isn't green at the moment, but from what I know, that will come. We're casting a spell. What are we casting a spell on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did we just do the weather? I think we just did the weather. Oh, that was so cool. And the way she laughed as well. Wow. Oh, I'm so excited. Does she have a name? Like if I go over her witchy poo. <gasps> witchy poo, the mean witch. Oh my God. That's the freaking best. That is the best. I could not have planned this any better. So freaking good. Witchy poo, the mean witch's dangerous cauldron. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Look, hold on a second. I know that I was supposed to be keeping Ryan happy by having the TV and stuff, but my cauldron really needs to go in here because there's nowhere else for it to go. So we're just going to sell all that stuff because who really cares? Because I'm a freaking witch and I've got a cauldron and I've also got a grimoire. <gasps> Look at the freaking grimoire. That is so cool. Oh my God. <laughs> Why is this the best though? Like, why is this actually so freaking cool? And also, why was that so much easier to do than I thought it was going to be? I thought it was going to be way harder to become a witch in The Sims 2. I have things to do, everyone, because my cauldron, it's a brewing. It is a brewing. <laughs> this is iconic. This is iconic. <sighs> okay, so hold on. Let's have a look at the grimoire. So let's um, check the abilities because I know a spell. What is the spell that I know is the question. So let's have a look at the grimoire. We'll find out. Also, Ryan, you just sleep peacefully for the minute. It's not like the reason I got a roommate was so I could then torment that roommate when I became a witch or anything. Anyway, let's find out what I can do. Let's have a look at the evil spells because I'm evil. I'm very mean. I'm witchy poo the mean witch after all. So spiritus poultrier, O spirit of the small and cowardly chicken, possess this sim that our laughter may thicken. I am totally going to be turning Ryan into a chicken. That is amazing. We've got Malifera attack him. Busy little bees attend to me. Attack this sim, make them flee. Oh my goodness. And then corruptus locus. What? Darkness and dastardly despair bring forth clouds into the air. Bring the lightning and cockroaches for now evil doth encroacheth. Wait, hold on a second. I think these might be ingredients. 
or they call them Ray Ray Ragins Ragins ingredients. But if we have a look at this one for the spirit of the cowardly chicken, uh, we need an eye of Newt and we need two Mystic Dust. So that's here. So I can create Mystic Dust and I can create Eye of Newt. So let's do that. Let's get all the ingredients that we're gonna need for our spells. <gasps> I am so sorry. This is insanely cool. This is insanely cool. Insanely cool. Really cool. Freaking cool. I'm so excited how cool this is. <laughs> so much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. All right, we've got some ingredients that we needed. We've got lots of ingredients, actually. I think Ryan is going off to work. When he comes home from work, I'm going to turn him into a chicken or do whatever the chicken spell is. That's fine. But I think I want to do a little bit more exploring. So let's call a taxi. So maybe we could go to Central Park West because it looks like it's got a lovely playground. I'm not saying I want to do any of these spells on kids or anything, or even if you can do them on kids, I have no idea. Why? What I'm saying is I just want to go to a place and have a look at the playground stuff because it looks cute. Look at this playground. How fun is that? That is so fun. I mean, we've got monkey bars in The Sims 4. We've got swing sets in The Sims 4, which is fun. We have slides for toddlers. These climbing frames were so cute. It was the same in The Sims 3. I loved all the playground stuff for The Sims 3 as well. And this little roundabout thing. Oh, my God. So cute. It's all adorable. Wait, is there a stage? Hold on a second. There is a stage. There is a piano. We can sing. I think I'm going to have to try and get my sim to sing. Just to see. Just to see. I had no idea this was here. This is exciting. All right. No big deal, witchy poo, but this is your moment to shine. Minerpy. Whip, whap, walk. Minerpy. Zibs, donk. Minerpy. Nerpy, zang, well, she's definitely got passion. She also knows how to clear out a room. <laughs> Benjamin Baldwin, you were the one that squished all of Francis's roaches. You're going to be attacked by bees. I'm going to make sure of it. I put a spell on you. She's doing it. She did it. Oh my God. Oh my God. The man is being attacked by bees. Oh my goodness, look at all the bees. Look at this man. Look at her laughing in the background. She is loving this. This is so funny. Look at her laughing. And there he is. <laughs> and then while he's still running away from bees, she's just casually meeting Peter Sims. Ben and Sime, we're going to do it. We're going to cast this spell on Peter Sims. I have no idea what it is, but she's doing it. Did she put him in a bad mood? Is that what it was? Aha, uh -huh. radio. So I have a feeling that I'm actually not going to be able to get Witchy Poo's skin to turn green because I think you have to be an atrociously evil witch and we are just the mean witch. So I have a feeling that I'm not going to be able to do that in this video. I'm okay with that though. Just her piercing purple eyes are enough for me. Like how beautiful is she as a witch? She looks incredible. I'm so glad I used the custom content for this Witchy Poo. So with that being said, we might just go home. I think we've got a few hours to wait until Ryan gets home because I really want to turn him into a chicken or do this chicken spell on him. We might study some more spells and see what other spells we can come up with during that time. That'd be cool. All right, so let's come up to the grimoire and we can study the path of darkness. Let's do that. I learned a new spell. Okay, well, what spell is it? Let's take a look. Check the abilities. Oh, Inflamo. From realms beyond, I call forth the flame. Burn hot and bright, Inflamo by name. Wowee, wowee. I might need to make some more mystic dust. Can I just, like, set the house on fire? <laughs> That's wicked. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Right. So witch be gone. I can choose to not be a witch if I don't want to. Look at her eyes. Oh my god, they're kind of creepy looking up like that. I'm sorry, but just witch be gone. You can also make vampiracil in D. Is that to become a vampire? And lycanthropic B, is that to become a werewolf? And then plantophic C, is that to become a plant sim? Or are those 
potions to remove those effects. So I'm not going to make any of them. <laughs> Hold on a second. I didn't even see this. So you can do spells on yourself. Cleanius Corpus. Is that like a hygiene spell to make you clean? Then there's Corpus Athleticus to make you more athletic. Corpus Fleshicus. I'm kind of concerned about that one. Cast spell. Spiritus Paltria. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, I see. I see. It makes sense that it would make him do chicken things rather than turning into a chicken. I don't know why I thought that'd be the case. <laughs> That's funny. Eventually. It's happened! It's happened! Her skin has turned green! It's because she is now Witchy Poo the Evil Witch! Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa, why did I just have a little bit of a witchy cackle? I was not intending to do that. Anyway, <laughs> am I becoming the Evil Witch? Anyway, that is so exciting. She looks amazing with her green skin! We just learned another new spell. I just want to see what is it. <gasps> Heavis Ho. Extract of sulfur, liver and beans. Make this sim sick if they can find a latrine. That is so good. All right. I'm going to fly to a lot, a community lot. And we'll go to the park east this time, just because that's the park we haven't been to yet. We also haven't been to the pavilion. She is going to fly on her freaking broomstick. Oh, she's in her outerwear. It must be winter. It is winter. <laughs> so freaking cool. So cool. Oh, with the witchy icon. That is so good. Wow, Witchy Poo is here. Witchy Poo is here. We're going to cast a spell. Kimberly, I'm so sorry, Kimberly. You were the first person that I saw. Heave us ho, Kimberly. Heave us ho. I feel awful. It must have been something I ate. And also, apparently, Witchy Poo is saying, it's been a so so week. I want to make this week better. I think it's been a fantastic week. You turn into a witch, my, my love. Seriously, I think it's been a great week. He was ho, so that's going to make Kimberly be sick. Awesome. Oh, it's it's very winter. It's very, very winter. You know what? We might actually just go home. Look, it was worth it to see Kimberly heave us ho in the freaking lavatory. Maru. <laughs> <gasps> Did you hear the way she talked then? It even kind of sounded witchy. Maru. <laughs> like she really got that kind of witchy talk going on. It was very witchy. I loved that. I loved that. That was wicked. You guys, that's actually where I'm going to end this video of The Sims 2 Apartment Life. I'm sorry that I made it all about Witchy Poo becoming a witch, but that's kind of a big part of it is witches for some reason. I don't know. Ask The Sims 2 why, not me. <laughs> I just see a witch and I can't resist making myself one. And with that being said, this is actually the last Sims 2 video of my nostalgia series. I've had so much fun exploring The Sims 2, especially because, like I said at the beginning of this video, I didn't have a lot of these packs. So a lot of these packs are my first impressions. It's been amazing to go through all of these packs of The Sims 2, learn so much about the game that I never even knew. And it has also been absolutely amazing to get tips from you guys. The Sims 2 community has been so amazing and it's just been so lovely to have those interactions with you on every single video. So thank you guys for your tips and for watching as well. So with that being said, if you'd like to see more of me and me playing more nostalgic packs of The Sims Past or any other Sims videos I've got coming your way, hit the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell next to it to be notified of every time that I upload. And if you liked this video, let me know by hitting the like button down below and leave me a comment as well. But guys, I hope you're having the greatest day ever and I will see you in the next video. Bye!